Hey guys, Paul here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I have a new awesome sunshade from Jawa. Wow. This is the sunshade for the glass roof for Tesla Model 3. It came in two pieces, the top and the rear glass roof for the rear passenger. All right, so today I will show you what comes in the box of this sunshade and I will share with you comparison between this new one, the quality and also functionality um, to the traditional sunshade out there in the market and then I'll show you how to install it and at the end we'll see how it looks in my Tesla Model 3. Oh, before we start, I just dropped new merch for Dad's Toys and Cars. You can check it out right below this video like this new sweater with DTC lighting in the front and Tesla lighting in the back. This will be awesome gifts for yourself or your loved ones for this holiday season. So don't forget to check it out. Now, let's go. First, let's see what comes in the box of this sunshade from Jawa. Wow. So it has its own um, storage bag, as you can see here. It's really cool. Um, and then on the inside, a plastic plier tool for installation. And this is the clip that you will use to install the sunshade. Came in super clean and organized in the plastic box. That's why I love Java's quality, which is really, really awesome. And the instruction manual, um, you can just scan the QR code. Um, obviously, you can, you will be able to fold this sunshade and then put in the storage bag. So these are two sunshades, one for the back and then one for the front. All right, let me open it up and see what it looks like. Okay, before I open it up, let me show you a closer look of the material real quick. So this is something different from what I see from a regular sunshade. It's a thinner material, but it's reflective. So that would help um, prevent the heat coming in from the glass roof. Really new and high quality um, fabric right there and then there's a tab right here so we show you which side it's up you have to put on the right side so it reflects that heat out and then let me try to open it oh let me compare to a regular um, sunshade that i have so this is the the material of the regular sunshade in the market it's it's actually much thinner and it's just a mesh cloth doesn't have any reflective material on it at all it's much thinner it's just dark it's just black color dark that's all uh, this is, should be the front or the top glass roof so we just fan it out open it boom done so this is the sunshade it's actually the same size, of course, but the installation is different. So the traditional one like this that you get from um, other brands or Amazon, you will get this. I believe when I first bought this, came with this clip right here. So it came with like five or a few spares, but in the past year, um, since you have to take off these clips every time you uninstall it and put it away, I lost all of them. I only have two left. Thank God I have two left so I can still put it in front of the bag, but no on the side. So that's a big advantage on this Jawa. Wow. I will show you later why. Let me open up the rear sunshade real quick. About the same way there. This is the rear one. So the, this is for the rear glass roof for the passenger in the back. All right, now we see what's in the box and then 
the closer look of the quality. Now, um, let me show you how to install it. Let's go. I got this Tesla Model 3 glass roof sunshade from Jawal or jawal-life.com. So if you are interested in this awesome sunshade, you can use code DADTC for extra 5% off. Now let's go and install it in my car. Let's start the installation. It's really simple. We're going to use these clips that was included in the package and then plastic tools, the trim removal tools that they gave us. So the front window, the front glass roof, we need four clips, two in the front and then two in the rear. Let's start with one first because it's going to be the same procedure we're going to do each one. So this is the clip. Let me show you real quick the, the clip that came in the package. So we are going to insert this part, you can see here, in to the headliner, in and then flip up. So this clip, this clip will stay there. Um, you don't have to remove every time you remove the sunshade. It's, there's no chance for you to lose it and it's so much more convenient when you use it daily. Now let's install it. So we just aim wherever you want to um, install the clip. Just aim it in and then use removal tools right here. So just, you see I push it in. Use the tool to open up the headliner just a little bit and then you just flip it in there. It's really, really simple. Now just stay there, there. So when you want to remove it, so do the same thing. But you don't have, remember you don't have to remove it every time you uninstall it. So just pop it open, take it out, just like that. Really, really simple. So simple installation, simple uninstall. All right, I'm just gonna install um, all four in the front and then I believe six in the back. Let me show you the location of each one. When you install these 10 clips, please make sure to follow these suggested locations on the screen to make sure when you install the sunshade, they all are fully secure. Now let's install the rest of the clips. Okay, installing sunshade is really, really easy. So make sure you have the right side up and then just rest it on that clip that we installed earlier. Same to the back. Here, installing is really simple. So we just make sure you have the right side up and then just rest it on the clip that we installed earlier. That's it. Clip in the back. Another clip. So from now on, to uninstall it, you just pull it out of the clip and then that's it done so much better than the previous one i had same thing to the one in the rear here just have to make sure you have the right side up and then just put it on and have it rest on the clip that you installed earlier so that's it it's done looks really nice and clean and you see the color of the sunshade is really similar to the color of the headliner so it looks really um, blending to the interior and it's really easy to install and uninstall when you don't need it this is the rear let me show you the overall look here it is looks really really nice Wow, I love how it's so easy to install and uninstall. The best part is probably um, when you take it out, when you don't need it anymore, and the quality is top notch. Way better quality than the previous one I had. All right, now let me show you how to fold it and then store it. All right, this is how you fold it down so you can um, store it in your car. So just grab one hand on the top part and one hand on the bottom part of the other side 
and then twist it in, just like that, and then pull it down. There, you can do it this way too. It doesn't have to be butterfly, actually, this is smaller. That's it, it's really small. And then you can put in the back, the store back that came in the package. So this way you can store it in, you can put it in, throw in the back of, of the car if you want, or in the trunk, or a perfect spot would be your front. This fits perfectly size to the front. This new sunshade turned out really, really good. Easy to install and easy to um, put it away and use it again. That's probably the best part. But right, if you are interested in this product, I will put the link in the description down below. Also a special discount code for you. Thank you so much for watching today's video, guys. And don't forget to click like if you like the video. And don't forget to subscribe to support the channels. Also for future content, we'll see you on the next video.